और अगली खबर ले लेते हैं नेशनल टेस्टिंग एजेंसी ने 13 जून को 2023 के लिए नीट यूजी के नतीजे घोषित किए देश भर के लाखों छात्रों ने 7 मई को परीक्षा दी थी इस साल अगर कितने लोग पास हुए उसके प्रतिशत की बात करें तो कुल छप्पन दशमलव दो प्रतिशत वो आंकड़ा है इतने छात्र जो है कि पास हुए हैं जो पिछले साल की संख्या के काफी करीब है कौस्तक जिसने देश में तीसरा स्थान हासिल किया उसने परीक्षा में 720 में से 716 अंक प्राप्त किए हमने उनसे बातचीत की आप भी देखिए Kostav, uh, welcome to Mirror now, and uh, thank you for uh, taking out your time. Congratulations for your uh, massive success in uh, you know uh, getting there where you have been uh, uh, you know making your preparations for. Well, how do you feel uh, where you have done exceptionally well in this year's uh, NEET undergraduate examinations? Well, first of all, thank you for inviting me here and providing me with this opportunity, and. I am overwhelmed with the result. I have exceeded my own expectations with this result. Right, uh, Kostav. Also, uh, tell us about your preparations, your journey. Uh, what was your inspiration? Why did you choose uh, this particular field? So, I initially, from a young age, had an interest in science and. my mother had suggested me to pursue medical as a career so i had undertaken a two year classroom program in akash bijus so that is where my journey neat journey started and when it came to the preparation i was initially lagging behind in some topics of class 11 so what i did was i first covered the class 12 syllabus completely thoroughly and then went back to revising class 11 syllabus and when the exam was approaching i gave mock tests under the intensive program of akash bijus which completely uh, you know eliminated my exam fear so i was feeling very free during the exam day and i just went out there and gave it my best Right, uh, Kostav, you scored seven hundred and sixteen out of seven uh, twenty marks. Well, uh, that is indeed a very successful uh, number. Uh, that you are yourself saying that you have outnumbered your own self. What has been your uh, preparation strategy? Firstly, for all the three subjects, being thorough with the NCERT textbooks and regular practice of questions like. whenever i complete a topic i do questions on that so that helps me build my confidence and uh, improves my speed in solving questions even during the actual exam right uh, cost of also you know when you're preparing for all these uh, competitive tests there are distractions like the social media the mobile phone how do you deal with that see there's a time for everything i uh, you know whenever i'm studying i try my best to avoid distractions i keep my phone away when i'm studying so that i don't have any distractions because doesn't matter how many hours you study per day if you're getting distracted then there's no use of it whatever you are studying you need to study it properly so i do my best to avoid any distractions during my study time right uh, cost of also uh, you know you have your friends around your family around your uh, well wishers how have they uh, received this they were also very happy like they were delighted with this kind of a result nobody expected that, that i would do this well like i have exceeded my own expectations as well as their expectations absolutely also all our viewers uh, watching you uh, many aspiring to be there where you are today you know scoring uh, this uh, these good marks in uh, the neat undergraduate examinations uh, you know give them a bit of your uh, success mantra i don't have any success mantra in particular is just constant hard work nothing else and yeah like i said before reading your textbooks thoroughly regular practice of questions if possible you can give mock tests to check yourself 
see where you stand at the all india level and yeah just keep practicing and hopefully that works out at the end and also the most important thing during an exam is to maintain your composure if you start panicking then it might affect your performance during the exam so when you give mock tests automatically that exam fear will go away so that is how you can remain calm and give it your best shot during the actual exam right uh, you know the first question uh, that everybody asks how many hours of uh, studies do you put in you know to secure uh, such good marks and also cost of uh, what are your uh, future plans to be honest i never counted the number of hours i studied per day like usually if i give you a rough estimates it's around 4 hours to 5 hours per day like once during the morning and then in the evening so it doesn't really matter how many hours you study per day how much how much uh, how sincerely you are uh, putting in that time into studies is what matters like how many hours are you effectively studying without any distractions actually learning something that is what matters right and also what about your future plans what do you uh, plan on to do next uh, right now i am going uh, i am trying to get into the aims new delhi college and i want to pursue oncology in the future all right uh, cost of uh, many congratulations to you and your family and those who have uh, supported you in the entire journey of your uh, grand success of securing the third position in uh, all india basis of the neat undergraduate uh, uh, this year thank you for being with us and uh, speaking with us on mirror now